welcome. And what's your name? My name is Dan Meyer. And how old are you? I am 59 years old. Okay, you look good. Thank you. You don't look too bad yourself. I know. Uh, so what you're going to do, because I think I've seen something, is this dangerous? This is extremely dangerous. Oh. Right. I first started swallowing swords in 1997. I practiced for four years, a total of about 13,000 unsuccessful attempts before I got my first sword down my throat in 2001. When I swallow a sword, I have to repress the gag reflex in the back of my throat, navigate a 90 degree turn down the epiglottis, flip open the epiglottis, slide the blade down into my chest cavity between the lungs, and there it actually runs into my heart. And I actually have to nudge my heart to the left. I've been injured several times. My worst injuries were in 2005 when I punctured my stomach while swallowing five swords at once. In 2010, I punctured my esophagus while swallowing two swords. And last year, I was trying to do 29 swords at once and kind of screwed up my throat for a few weeks. So it was oh kind of tough. Yeah. What I'm going to attempt tonight, I've never done it before. So this is really dangerous stuff here. What I'm going to attempt to do tonight is going to be so much bigger than anything I've ever done before. Bigger meaning more dangerous. Bigger meaning more dangerous. Are you sure about this? I'm pretty sure. Now, I've not done it before, so I'm not sure if it's going to work. What? Simon, this is my purpose, my calling. This is my proof that it, the impossible is not impossible. All right, Dan, well, we're rooting for you. Good luck. Thank you. I'm scared. He's never done this before. Don't try this at home. That's just the beginning. Oh, no. What I have here is a car axle, 1929 car axle. This weighs about eight pounds. I've got to make sure it doesn't go through me when I let go of it. This thing is very, very heavy. Ladies and gentlemen, the car axle. take it to another level. That is only part of a car. We're gonna do something better than that. How about we do an entire car? Where's Nick? Nick, I'm gonna need you out here. Nick, come here. What? Do an entire car. What I have here is about a 20-inch sword with a little metal plate on this. Uh -huh. Nick, would you take a look at that? Make sure it is a, a real sword. It's definitely a real sword. Yeah, and now I got your fingerprints on it in case anything goes wrong. Great. So what we're gonna do is they're gonna pull out this car and we are going to attach that car straps to this sword and I'm going to attempt to pull that car all the way across the stage, no hands, using just my stomach and my mouth. We can clamp that What's on there. What am I gonna do? I need you to get in the car and steer the car, and uh, don't hit the brake until we get close to the edge. Okay.
crazy person. <laughs> we did it, man. We did. Thank you. Crazy person. Oh, my gosh. Uh, Mel. I don't know why you would want to do this, but I couldn't stop looking. Does it hurt? Uh, it does a little bit. Uh, don't try this at home. <laughs> no chance of that. <laughs> Howie, what did you think? You know, on this show, we've seen strength acts and we've seen sword swallowers. The thought that those two things could blend is unbelievable. Thank you. I have to say, you know, some of the acts that come onto the stage where I kind of cannot look because I'm so scared, I had to like peek all the time. But it was pretty impressive. Dan, you are certifiably nuts. Thank you. But I think what you did was incredible. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna vote. Let's start with Hattie. Yes! Mel. Yeah, I'm gonna have to say yes. Thank you. Heidi? I'm gonna give you a yes. Thank you. Dan Mayer, I am very happy to tell you, you have four yeses, you're through to the next round. Yes! Thank you. That's why I do it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well done. You all right? I am. I'm shaking, but uh, I'm good. You pulled a car across the stage with a sword inside you. Thank you for not pushing the brakes or what had an abrupt stop. Yeah, they will. We are. Oh. We're on a roll now, guys. It's like a treadmill. You can't get off. I like it when it's like this.